Yo, what's going on, Sexy Sam? Let us go today. We're here doing a ranked 1v1, and I am playing Erlang Shen because he got a buff. Now, it's not great because I'm fighting a Poseidon, and Poseidon obviously hard counters Erlang Shen, but, but Erlang Shen did get a buff, and it's quite a good one, too, if you ask me. It's, um, well, actually, first off, should I start Blackthorn or should I just start Ichival? Like, do I think I'm going to get owned early? If yes, Blackthorn. If no, Ichival. I go Ichival here. From the magma I go Ichival here. And not because I don't think I'm going to get owned, but in, in fact, because I think I will get owned and I just don't care. Because once I get Ichival online, I'm going to own. So Erling got a lot of buffs. Ichival is a very good item. Uh, if you didn't watch the Tilt video yesterday, I forgot to upload it. Uh, I uploaded it at 8 p.m. Eastern, so... Go watch that. It is very informative about all the stuff they changed and added during this patch. Uh, but just to break down a couple of things that I'm going to be using right now, it is Ichival is back in the game. Stone Cutting is back in the game. Shift the Shield is back in the game. Ansilo is back in the game. Metallus is back in the game for Hunters. Uh, Fail Not and Erendite are also available for Hunters and Assassins. Um... There's also a lot of other stuff. So if you want to know about all that other stuff, make sure to go watch that video. But for now, all you need to know for this Erlang video is I think mages suck. Um, and Ichival is a very, 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 very good item. Um, and I'm going to fight you. Hello. Ooh, he's got horrific on me. He's got horrific on me. All right. He's going to hit five and alt my ass. No, thank you. No, thank you, senor. Um, so Erlang got buff or like arguably just reverted. Uh, but the revert is a straight up massive buff. And that is that... He gets his knockup in shield or in turtle form again. It's shield form, it's turtle form, whatever you want to call it. But in that form, he gets a knockup now, which is so good for bursting. It's so ridiculous. With at Ichival, on top of the fact that you now get a knockup and you are bursting for so much damage. If you don't know what Ichival does, uh, don't worry. I'm here to tell you. I'm here to help. That's you know, that's what I do. I'm a, I'm a yappative young man. I'm 29, you know, I'm not 30, so I'm still young. Okay. I don't believe I live here. Yeah. He's just got, he's got his passive, so I die. That's fine. That's fine. I really wish I could get my freaking silver branch, though. Or not silver branch. Uh, itch of all. I hate that I can't get it yet. Once I get Ichival, I just run at him. I think. Well, Ichival and then Shoguns, because obviously attack speed is massive. Um. <clears throat> Hello. Like, he'd be dead right now. If he did this when I had Ichival finished, he would be dead. I'm, I think he might still be dead, to be honest. Hmm. Maybe not. Okay, yeah, he just clears too much. He just clears too well. Unlucky. Does he have Kraken again? He might have Kraken again. I'm just gonna back. Grab this and Shoguns. That is not Shoguns. Grab tier one Shoguns. Um. Yeah. So Poseidon is obviously a 100% counter matchup to Erling Shen because I can't use my three against him. Um. And I don't have a CC immune alt or anything like that. So it's just a one-to-one -one counter on almost every ability. 
which obviously stinks, but um, I think Erling might be good enough to actually just overcome it, but not early game. Early game, you know, I don't compete in clear, I don't complete in burst, I don't complete in, or compete in damage. I'm just not a good enough character to compete yet. Um, you know, he, he is going to prioritize clear and all this stuff, so I'm just going to have to wait get down maybe 1500 gold 2000 gold um and just pray to god that i can like beads his alt with my alt as well like i alt he or oh, sorry he alts i alt i beads and then i full combo him while avoiding the one because if he knocks me back with the one i will still die Okay, I am dead. I am dead. There is the Kraken. Unfortunate. That's crazy. That's crazy. I could have maybe beads that. I don't know. I feel like I was dead there anyways. I feel like there's no real point in beating that. I'm gonna need a serrated and I'm gonna need a an anti-heal XE. What does my alt do if I level it? It just gives me a bigger heal. And my three is better than that, to be honest. I just don't do enough damage right now. I mean, he doesn't do enough damage either, clearly. Ow, that motherfucker is maxing his one. That hit me for 300, dude. Yeah. I was going higher than Emian to reflect my damage back to me. Unlucky. Now, oddly enough, I still think I can win. I just need some more burst. Some more items. Erlang is very item heavy and Poseidon is very not item heavy, so. Oh, if I get this kill. Nice, that's really big. That is really big. 580 gold, actually. Um. Ooh, and a red buff. Five hundred eighty gold and a red buff. All right, let's go Xy here. Just grab tier two. Why not? And I'm gonna go the anti heal one, obviously. Um, he's gonna go. I mean, he already has horrific. I'm probably just gonna go sprint second item. Or I'll go shell, one or the other. They're both good here. Um. Ooh. There's only one up. All right, this Shogun's really gave me a bunch of attack speed. I am happy with this. You got a 500 pot. I just can't ever three, man. I just can't ever three. It's so shitty. Your middle tower is under attack. 
I'm just gonna go for Because if I could three, like I'm maxed out, that, that turtle form is giving me a 300 HP shield right now. Yeah, 250 shield health. So like, if I could just turtle form, I guarantee I live there. And not only do I live, I kill him because my burst is better. But like, I just can't get there, man. Yeah, he's just, he's just zoning me out, man. Does this give cooldown? No. I don't know. There is nothing sharper, more brutal than this. I kind of just want to go hastened. So he can't run from me. Kate. That's a magical power swing item. Very good one at that, but. He lived through that. That's crazy. Even though I'm, what is it, like 1,300 gold down, I'm still doing okay in these fights. Not great, but okay. He's going hastened here as well. I got the movement speed on the on the ground for me here. I'm chilling. Really good damage there, to be honest. Really, really good damage. Nice. Um, he did go 500 pot and I actually think that I'm catching up to him. Like he built a 500 pot and I think I'm gaining, I think I'm gaining gold back. Not XP obviously, but I think I'm getting gold. I'm actually going to upgrade my beads here. Oh, it's already upgraded. Nice. Um, you know, I could just go Magi's actually. Magi's would be pretty good. Alright, he's got his hastened here. Obviously, the only reason he would actually back there is to finish that item. I gotta wait for my for my beads, and then once I get my beads online, I might be able to kill him here. Oh, how the fuck did he get there, gamer? 500 pot just ran out. Alright. Not bad for me. Perfect. Perfect. He thought... He thought that he could just run past me. Or run at me. No siree. No siree. Get in their minions. Let's go. That is tower down. That hastened really carried me there. 
him going hastened is actually bad i think because if he if he's running at me with hastened movement speed he cannot backstep that he just can't like it, it, he's not fast enough to backstep that reaction time maybe you know i got a little bit of a serrated edge a little bit of life steal a little bit of sustain not bad and no relics though I could try to do bull demon, but like he'll just shred that motherfucker, you know, with the alt. All right, cracking down. I'm gonna go straight to bull demon here. I don't think he can stop me from doing this. I think I'll do too much damage, to be honest. For him to get here in time. Perfect. Perfect. Good stuff. Good stuff. Good stuff. And I got beads and thorns up too. I could still maybe kill him. No. Depending on Kraken timer. Like this. Out of my path. Oh, you're dead. Perfect. Perfect, dude. And then I have I have both hastened and serrated for my move speed, so even though. Even though he's Poseidon, when his, two, when his two runs out, I am faster, which is super nice for me. I do wonder if a Magi's would be good here. I'm not going to lie to you. I feel like a Magi's would go kind of hard. I feel like a Magi's would go kind of hard. I also really don't want him to get this red buff, but it's very scary for me here. Nice. I'm happy with that. Nice. Yeah, I mean, he can't run at me. That's that's what I'm saying about the hastened. It gives him this kind of false confidence that he can chase me. But if you're running at me at full speed and I'm kind of close to you, right? Like you're chasing me at full speed. If I turn, you're not going to be able to stop that, that momentum you have going forward fast enough to stop me from getting to you. And when I touch you, it's over. Like if I get to you as Erling Shen, it's over. So I'm pretty sure I went zero and four there. And then I came all the way back with a four, four victory. That's, I mean, hey, that's right there in the book with don't give up, you know, don't, it's not over till it's over type scenario. And I knew, you know, I knew that uh, Erling Shen is very uh, item dependent. Poseidon is not very item dependent. So my power spikes are going to be way further ahead than his power spikes. I just know that because I've played both gods a lot. You know, I Poseidon's my most played god ever with 12,000 worshippers. Erlang Shen is a pretty high up there warrior with 2,000 worshippers. So, you know, I've played both gods enough to realize what I need to do and what I don't need to do in this kind of matchup. Um, hence why I didn't go Aegis because I knew you get damage mitigation from your alt. You also get damage mitigation from thorns, 15%. So... With my alt plus thorns, there's no way in hell that his combo ever one hits me. Um, and then on top of that, I have the beads to chase him down when he ones me because that's the only way he's going to get me off of him other than obviously the alt is his one. So, um, yeah, and then I think, you know, like I said, his hasten to bait him himself. Um, he would have been much better off not going auto attack, I believe, like fully going ability based with cooldown. 
on just spamming those threes, you know, even, even not going thorns, like thorns was a pretty big misplay for him. I think he goes either Sprout, which is the, the, the sprint that roots to get me off of him. Um, or I go, or, or, or he goes, um, uh, cooldown meditation to make sure that my, his three is always under him. So I never get my three off during a fight. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, y'all, peace.